Welcome back to my channel Mathematics. Today we have a very tricky and relaxing challenge. A divided by 4 times 3 minus 5 inside parentheses. Maybe this is the easiest challenge ever seen, but a lot of students make this common mistake. They don't know what is the correct answer, correct approach. So right now I want you to pause the video, try to solve it by yourself. Choose one option, what they think is the correct answer, option A, option B or option C. And in the end of the video we will check our answers. It will be really interesting, I promise you. So here's our challenge. We have 8 dividing by 4 times 3 minus 5. Here's our challenge. As you can see, we have division sign right here, we have multiplication sign right here, we have subtraction sign. One part of students start with division, another part of students start with multiplication. But in terms of math, we should know what is the correct order, because whatever order of operation we select, it's going to create a different answer. We should know what is the correct order, right? Because let's look at it. One part of students say that option A, this is the correct answer. A divided by 4, which is equal to 2. 2 times 3, which is equal to 6. 6 minus 5, which is equal to 1. A lot of students say that option option A, option 1, this is the correct answer. But in terms of math, we should know what is the correct order. Let's look at this PEMDAS order of operation. This is the most popular order of operation in the world. All internet libraries, scientific, graphic calculator works according to PEMDAS order of operation. And how does PEMDAS work? PEMDAS works from the top to the bottom. It means that higher position, higher priority. Parenthesis has the higher position. It means that first we should evaluate the expression inside parenthesis. Next, exponents. It's like 5 square, 5 cube, like that. Next, multiplication division group. And last step is addition and subtraction. So right now, let's solve a challenge according to PEMDAS. Here's our challenge. A dividing by 4 at times 3 minus 5 inside parentheses. As you can see, parentheses we have right here. It means that first we should evaluate the expression inside parentheses. This is our first step. What do we have inside parentheses? Inside parentheses we have subtraction side. It means that our second step is subtraction. We should subtract 3 minus 5. What do we have? We have 8 dividing by 4. Inside parentheses we have minus 2, right? And what is our third step? Multiplication or division? Uh, multiplication or division. Division sign, this is the first sign from left to right. We should solve the challenge in a strict order from left to right. Division we have right here, as you can see. Multiplication we have right here. So our third step is division. A divided by 4, which is equal to 2, right? 2 times minus 2, this is our first step. As you can see, we don't have any exponents, we don't have any division. 2 times minus 2, which is equal to minus 4. Option C. Option C, this is the correct answer to this challenge, because we solve this challenge according to PEMDAS order of operation. PEMDAS is the most popular order of operation in the world. So, a lot of students all the time argue with each other about the correct answer. Another part of students start with the multiplication, one part of students start with division, but in terms of math, it's really bad to solve the challenges randomly. We should know what is the correct order, because whatever order of operation we select, it's going to create a different answer, right? So, we should know what is the correct order. First, we find our parentheses. We should evaluate the expression inside parentheses at first. Inside parentheses, we have subtraction sign. 3 minus 5, which is equal to minus 2. Our second step is uh, division, because division sign is the first sign from left to right. In a strict order from left to right. A divided by 4, which is equal to 2. 2 times minus 2, this is our last step multiplication, which is equal to minus 4. Option C, this is the correct answer. Minus 4, this is the correct answer to this challenge. I hope your answer is the same as mine. I hope you learned something new. But definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. I have a lot of videos on my YouTube channel. So thank you for your time. Have a great day and see you guys in the next videos.